Cafe Manager at LaMille Coffee, uh, the cafe that's in the Four Seasons Hotel Baltimore. Zoo. Okay, so this is the um, Hario Siphon, and this is what we call siphon coffee. Sometimes it's also called um, reverse vacuum coffee. You know, I we also like to call it, and when we, you know, here in the shop, we call it Science Project Coffee because let's face it, there's a Bunsen burner and there's some glass chambers that brings together for me in my head Science Project and Science Class, which usually ended pretty badly for me personally. Okay, well, what we have here is we actually have um, our Bunsen burner, super fun, and I'm going to keep that on a low to medium heat. Here I have my freshly ground coffee. Today we're using a single origin from Colombia. With the application of heat to the bottom, that's actually going to cause the water to rise up to the top chamber. Between the two chambers here is actually a metal and cloth filter, and that's what's actually going to filter our coffee after the extraction process. Here we have our coffee and our water, and we're just going to incorporate that. This is called the immersion brewing method. It's when the coffee and the water are in constant contact with each other the entire time. And we've started our timer here. And we're just going to let this go for about two minutes. So as you can see here, what's being formed is called the crust. And this is all the gases from the roasting process of the beef that are basically getting trapped. And after about a minute or so, um, we're actually going to increase our flame here for five seconds. It's going to give it our one last push. Going to remove that. And then we're going to do what's called breaking the crust. Just break the crust, which releases all of the gases. I'm going to stir four times clockwise and then stop. You don't want to over stir your coffee because that's going to over agitate it. And now, as you can see, when we take away the heat that actually causes gravity to take over and the coffee is now being filtered through that metal and cloth filter right there and it's actually being dropped to the lower chamber because we've taken the heat away. Um, sometimes you can rub the lower chamber with the cloth. That's really just to, again, remove the heat. Look, there's all of our bubbles coming through. There it is, right there. It's going to be a flavorful cup of coffee. Alrighty, and as you can see here in the top chamber, there's a slight dome to the coffee. Um, and that's actually an indication that it was done correctly. It actually becomes your pouring vessel. This is your coffee pot. Um, and this is what you would pour directly into your cup. Okay, so the reason why LaMille is here in Baltimore, which is, a, you know, a little funny because it's an LA-based coffee roasting company. Um, and that's because of the relationship between LaMille and Michael Mina restaurants. Michael Mina actually uses LaMille as his coffee program. So if you go to a Michael Mina restaurant and, you know, order a after-dinner coffee, you're drinking LaMille coffee. And that's because LaMille coffee is, you know, very high quality and Michael Mina wanted to have a very high quality coffee program. This is essentially a latte that is made with half and half, steamed half and half, and that's what a breve latte is. It's, it's essentially um, a latte that would have a little bit higher fat content, obviously because of the half and half, and that just leaves a really rich mouthy. When you when you steam half and half, you know, because of the higher fat content, actually is a little bit more difficult um, to you know to aerate it, just because you know skim milk aerates like really really quickly. Why? Because it's mostly water, whereas you know half and half is the polar opposite. So again, a heavier mouthfeel, you know, and again, it has sort of a luxurious feeling to it, you know, and I think that's why people really like it. And I think the reason why we don't normally put it on the menu is because it isn't something that wouldn't be available. Um, if you have half and half in your shop, then you can make a breve latte.